Item number SCP-5057. Index. The secret ingredient is mayo. Object class. Safe. Special containment procedures. SCP-5057 is to be kept in frozen storage. No contact is to be made with SCP-5057 without clearance from the site supervisor. Description. SCP-5057 is a brand chocolate cake. Anomalous effects occur when a subject makes contact with the cake. The subject will be instantly transported to an alternate world which varies between subjects. However, it is always a child's birthday party and a chocolate cake is always being served. Guests of the party will prompt the subject to eat the cake. Subject returns to our world after eating one slice of the cake at the party. Investigations of restaurants have yielded no anomalous findings. Addendum 5057-1 Discovery SCP-5057 came into Foundation custody after the disappearance of Michael hereby referred to as SCP-5057-1 at his 10th birthday after making contact with SCP-5057. All witnesses were given Class A amnestics and a cover story for the disappearance. SCP-5057-1 has not been located within the alternate world. See Addendum 5057.2. Addendum 5057.2. Incident Report. On 22. SCP-5057-1 reappeared at the site of his birthday party. Foundation agents monitoring local news heard of this and extracted subject. A cover story was disseminated and amnestics were applied accordingly. Genetic tests match that of Michael. It is to note that subject biologically remained 10 years old despite being missing for 20 years. Addendum 5057.3 Interview Log Interviewed SCP-5057-1 Interviewer Doctor Forward Interview conducted to find out what subject experienced while missing. While he reports being conscious during this time, he still only has the mental capabilities and speech of a typical 10-year-old child. Begin Log Doctor. Hi, Michael. I understand you are very scared and confused from what's been going on. But I want you to know that you are safe now. I'm just going to ask a few questions. Do you remember your 10th birthday party? SCP-5057-1. Yes. It was a long time ago. My cousins and grandma and grandpa were there. Can you tell me about the cake you had? I asked Mum and Dad for a chocolate cake. They're really tasty. After I blew out the candles, they gave me a slice and I took a bite. Then everything around me was different, like it was someone else's birthday. What happened after that? I was scared. I couldn't find Mum or Dad. The adults there wouldn't help me. They just wanted me to eat some cake. I was so scared, so I ran away. He shifts nervously in his seat. Then I was at another birthday party like that one. And I just kept running, and I didn't want to eat the cake. Do you remember how long you did this for? It was really long. After a while, I was just in a dark room, and I was there for a really long time. Then a chocolate cake appeared on a plate, and I ate it because it was so long since I ate something so delicious. Then I was at home again, but Mum and Dad weren't there. I see. Thank you, Michael. You did great. End log.